everybody, this is Kristen, and I have the June Maxi Makes box uh, to open up today. I, I know it's already July. Um, my poor box went to Puerto Rico and then came back and then was delivered on Monday and then finally showed up. So it's been about a uh, couple days late thanks to uh, unforeseen circumstances. Um, but let's get into the box. So Maxi Makes, if y'all don't know, is a monthly box that is specifically curated so that you have a small project that you can complete in a weekend or a couple weekends, um, but essentially before you get your next box. So it's nothing that's going to be huge bed size quilts. It's going to be sm something smaller and it's always teaching you different uh, skills. So that's what I really love about this box, is I'm always given the opportunity to learn something new. So, this time we are doing the Woven Strips quilt. So, we are making that guy right there. And, uh, so it's going to show us, you know, how to do some uh, of these really neat blocks in a simple way, which is awesome. So. We have the fabrics for the quilt top in binding. It's Art Gallery Fabrics. We have our pattern for this, of course. And um, there's an online video tutorial that Maxi does every month to show us how to do um, that month's project. And that's only available to folks who subscribe to the Maxi Mailbox. So if you are a subscriber, you get to watch that. And uh, <clears throat> if not, maybe maybe you should subscribe. All right, let's get into it. So we have this month fusible interfacing, a 15 yard roll, which prevents stretch on bias edges of quilt blocks, stabilizes quilt top edges before basting, fuses leftover batting pieces together smoothly. That would be really useful for me and stabilizes buttonholes, collars, cuffs, inseams, etc. So, that's going to come in handy. Ooh, okay, I'm loving the fabric this month. It is so bright, it is so pretty. This is completely up my alley. So, um, we already have strips that are cut out for us in this really pretty um, yellow and bright pink and black and white fabric. And then this amazing teal with orange and green and pink and white and <clears throat> so many different colors on it, flowers. We have some more of that same stripey fabric. We've got a stripey teal fabric, which of course, if you know me at all, these teal fabrics make me very, very happy. I love teal. And check out this gorgeous yellow fabric. So this is what we have um, in our box this month for fabrics to create that project. And so you're going to see um, with the strips, they're already cut. So they're pretty much ready to go um, for sub cutting or whatever things we need to do to um, get ready for the project. And then the rest of them are cut in a way that we don't have to do a ton of cutting and hope that we have everything right and then, you know, have a ton left over like most projects. So that's what the other thing that's great. So we have that. Um, let's see. We have an Ulfa rotary blade, which always comes in handy. A nice 45 millimeter, which is exactly what I use. So I love having these and I love that this one comes in its like own little case. So I can actually take this um, on a trip with me and I'm not worrying about it getting out and cutting me or cutting my fabric or anything like that. We have some absolutely stunning Guterman thread. Beautiful teal to go with all that beautiful teal fabric that we have. And, like every month, we get some tea. And this month, I have Sweet Tangerine Positive Energy. 
So that is our uh, box for this month. And then of course, like I said, you get the video. So that's an extra bonus feature um, for what we have. And this month we are working on uh, doing strips in a new way and stabilizing bias block edges. So that's the skills that we're going to be learning this month. So pretty awesome. Um, I'm excited. So that is what we have. Uh, let me know, are you going to make this project? And if so, are you using the fabric, the amazing fabric that came in our box this month? Or are you going to try to do it on your own? Um, let me know what you think. Do you subscribe? If not, why not? You totally should. And um, I don't think I have anything else. Uh, Fourth of July tomorrow, for those of you who are in the United States, happy 4th, happy Independence Day. Hopefully y'all are able to celebrate with your family and friends. And I think that's it. So I will see y'all again next, no, nope, I take that back, at the end of this month, at this point now, uh, for the July box. So do you have questions? Drop me a line. I love to hear from you. If it's just a comment, that's great too. And I will see you later.